Hey you guys, hey Auto Straddle. I am Julie Goldman. Brandy Howard. And you're watching. What's it called? In your in your box office? Oh shit, he got the gum. Let me just get my gum going. Coming out of, Coming the, out box of the box office. office. Putting it in your box. We can't discuss this on camera, okay? Alright. So, it's Julie and Brandy in your box office. Yeah. Okay. I'm Julie Goldman. I'm Brandy Howard. And this is in your box. Office. Thank you. You see, we're just two girls in this world in Hollywood trying to get our dreams made. We're trying to get our movie done, girl. We are giving you executive, a lesbian, a movie, a realness. But no one wants to help us, so we're fucked. Hey! Instead, we're just gonna go to other people's movies and talk shit. And we'll be in your box office. It's another word for vagina. Basically, we're gonna like review movies and give our opinions about them. We saw one today that we must discuss, and it's called. Douche This is great. You're a white devil. After, after, blue people always love and talk. <laughs> Julie driving, take one. Hi everybody, it's me, Julie and Brandy, and we're... <laughs> it's me, Julie and Brandy. I mean, it's... <laughs> we're driving up to Universal Studios Hollywood to go see the movie of Avatar today. And we're really excited about it. It's with the GPS, Universal Studios Boulevard. Yeah, because in LA, you have to go to Universal Studios to go to the movies. It's raining, it's shitty outside, it's been a fucked up week, <laughs> but we're going to go out there and we're going to see Avatar and we're going to let you know what we think of it. Wah, 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 wah. I can charge a lesbian fourteen dollars to park. What a city walk! It's an wow. incredible walk. This is amazing. Except when I saw The Holiday uh, and Yumi and Dupree. We couldn't, we walked out. We couldn't, we, we couldn't even finish the end. I mean, if we knew we were going to see Blair Witch Project, it was made for $3.50. We might go, mm, that was annoying, but whatever. I mean, it wasted no one's time and it wasted no one's money. $500 million. Yeah. If you're I mean, so worried about indigenous people and Oh, Corporate America please. and the army and the military. Why don't you take your 500 fucking million dollars down to Africa and go save up some fucking tribal... Seriously. You could save Haiti and the Dominican Republic, rebuild the continent of Africa. <laughs> With 500 million dollars, you could fix all of the countries. We're not going to convince you that this isn't good. And listen, there were two lesbos lurking around. Oh my god. That was cool. That was cool. Uh, on the positive side, I will say there was some cool looking shit. <laughs> an anger and a rage issue that's true and a chip on our shoulder <laughs> that um, comes from this town which is Hollywood yeah and this industry mm -hmm. which is the business of show show business and a lesbo would cross the screen <laughs> and she'd say how did she get that part I'm like she's an extra New Zealand <laughs> 500 million dollars and this movie at least hired two lesbians. There was one scene where there's a lesbian standing back there. You all like, saw it. I was like, how the fuck did she get that part? And I should be getting that audition for that lesbian fucking extra part. <laughs> Can I just say something? Okay. What is this gonna be? I like these kinds of movies. I like sci-fi. I love this shit. I love The Matrix. I love Lord of the Rings. I love all that shit. But this was not that. It was gorgeous, it was. But at least Lord of the Rings was real. Even the avatars were so, like that video game, computer generated thing. Like, are Pixar. we expected to believe that none of them are overweight? Not one blue person of the Nia tribe. <laughs> but let's just say, yeah, take a land, kill all the fucking natives <laughs> on it, and then make it a gorgeous landscape and we'll use it for real to shoot movies. 
That's what Peter Jackson did for Lord of the Rings. Did you know how many New Zealanders he killed? For that movie? Unfortunately, he didn't kill the one lesbian extra and the star of this film, <laughs> who is from New, Ze New Zealand. Oh, that, oh, please. I want to go find James Cameron, knock on the door, take off my glove. Hello? Oh. How dare you, sir? How dare you? It was so heavy handed, and the story was unbelievable. It was, I mean, it's obviously like a parallel to oil. These savages didn't even do anything. Yeah, they weren't even dangerous. Why? They didn't, the people didn't even do anything. And of course it's a parallel to Afghanistan and Iraq. Um, there wasn't even a 9-11. Simply... Yeah. We're mad about 9-11, blue people. They made the military look like a bunch of cocksuckers. It was the movie that made us annoyed. And maybe George Bush does make up wars and the movie sucked. The military believes that what they're doing is against dangerous people. It was the so stupid. The film had such an agenda. We could be wrong because of, well actually, we we're, not wrong. we're not wrong. We, we could be looking through glasses that are colored with badge, the right way. Badge, lesbo, Fine. angry, rage. Fine. If we didn't know when a 115 year old woman named Rose <laughs> tossed a fucking blue medallion into the ocean <clears throat> that he was a little bit hokey and could go a little over the top. We definitely know now. So we're gonna do just a reenactment for anyone who doesn't um, wanna pay the $14 parking fucking ticket plus the $15 per ticket. Plus the $30 dollars for two and the $25 for popcorn, Diet Coke, and Whoppers. <laughs> So yeah. if you don't want to do that, you can see the quick, all-lady version, Gavatar. Which is... <laughs> Gavatar. Action. Avatar! My brother's dead! I don't know what I'm gonna do. My legs don't work! Oh. The natives of Pandora are savages! <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna replace your brother? Yeah. Do you have a PhD? No. You don't even smoke. I want to learn from you, lady, hairy lady. You're a white devil. We don't want you on Pandora. My body's blue and hairless, just like you. Can't you see? No, I can't see. Teach me a montage of learning. We'll teach him everything we know. <laughs> Make me a part of the Ukutukutukutuk tribe. Here we are, shooting arrows. Then we're flying on weird things. I'm gonna try and kill me, but you gonna... must bond with it. Then it gonna... chooses. Don't look it in the eye. I won't. Then I'm going to put my tail in it. Oh. Do you like it? You chose you, and it chose itself, and now we are the chosen. Well, it's like we're Jews. It's getting away. Oh no! It's getting away. I'm killing it again. Nope. All right. <laughs> I got you. Okay. You're not gonna get in our tribe if I you don't do... fucking I'm get this do it. guy. I'm gonna kill it. I'm gonna kill it. Okay. I'm gonna kill it. Gosh. Oh. I see you, brother. Thank you for letting me eat you. It's even 12 to the 10th power, and it has more than the human brain. You can't attack them. You don't know what you're talking about, lady. Military people are from the south. It's video diary day 37. I like these blue people. They're nice. The ladies, all the junk's out. My junk's out flapping around. I want to stay here. You're one of us. You get to choose a lady. I've already made my choice. Who is it? Well, I can tell you it's not Nancy. <laughs> I can tell you that. I never really liked or cared for Francine or Jessica. I choose you. And I choose you. But really, if you didn't choose me, I'd still do it. I'd still rape you. Let's ride each other in a blue tentacle. <laughs> they killed the tree! They killed the tree! That's really gonna ruin my day. Hang in there! Hang in there! Could keep smoking! Hang in there, Grace! Hang in there! And then you're wrapped up in tentacles, and you die. Oh! Grace does. Brother, translate for me. It'd be an honor if you translated for me. Well, there was 20 minutes of translate for me. I will translate for you, my brother. I see you, my brother. Let me feel you. Let's feel each other and see each other. Everybody, everybody. Get your clans, get your friends together. Put your little new blue outfits on. The ladies, put that, the, and then you're gonna put your clicky clacks on, because at first for a while it was little pasties, and now since it's the end of the movie, you're gonna put your clicky clacks on. You're gonna get your friends together, we're gonna fly our weird looking birds. But we don't need to have weapons of mass destruction. We have weapons of the heart. I love a language that makes you think they're gonna throw up on you any second. 
the rating from in your box office, oh, okay. the official rating from your box office is not even anything in there. Your box is empty? Yeah. It's vacant and vacuous. And left like a, a, a shell of itself. Just a shell of myself. Okay, Brandy? A shell of myself? So Our boxes are empty. Are empty thanks to fucking James Cameron. Oh. Sing the Avatar song. Avatar. <laughs> Avatar. <laughs> Mountains not attached to anything. Military, you are so evil. I'll just no. Let me sing in their language. Oh, it's like the crossover hit for the for the natives in yeah. their language. So